you know, like so many other families when I was a child, we, we had gardens every summer uh, in order to freeze and can and uh, keep food uh, where we could use it in the winter months, uh, especially if you had a large family. And we only had uh, four children in my family, but uh, it was a struggle sometimes with a single mom to, to feed us, I'm sure, even though we were never given that information. Some things were just kind of obvious, but we were not the only ones. There were families everywhere all around us that uh, had these kind of issues to deal with. Well, I remember um, one uh, occasion where there was a house fire in the area, and this family who had more children than we did, um, they lost everything, everything they had. And my mom um, did something that caught my eye. What she did was she went to the freezer that we had, and um, it was full of frozen foods and things of that nature that we had put up during the summer months. And she began to take stuff out, a lot of stuff, because she knew that that family didn't have anything. And, and she was assuming they had a way to keep it. Hopefully they did, uh, because we went to where they were staying after the fire and we gave them that food. And, you know, uh, a child would look at that and say, well, what about us? What about us? But friend, I want you to know that no matter what's going on in your life today, there is somebody, I promise you, that's doing a little worse than you are. And you can find somebody to be Jesus too. That was just one occasion that I saw displayed in front of me by my mom's example that lives on inside of us today. And I thank God for that. You know, the Bible says that he loves a cheerful giver. God loveth a cheerful giver. You you give out of a heart of love and abundance because you know what? Next week, it could be somebody bringing you uh, a gift because you are in desperate times. You know, um, we don't know what tomorrow holds. But one thing we do know is that God loves us all. Friend, I hope you have a wonderful day and God bless you.